going to be reviewing for you a new mineral sunscreen. It's the Annabella Naturals SPF 50 Zinc Oxide Serum. It's supposed to be, has a lot of claims. I'm gonna go over with you about this product. And if you're interested, please keep watching. We're gonna start with the claims first, and then I'm gonna show you how it applies on its own and under makeup. Keep watching. This box is covered with a lot of claims. Here we have the front. It says it's SPF 50, contains non-nano zinc, vitamin C, vitamin E, hyaluronic acid, is non-comedogenic, fragrance-free, organic ingredients, water-resistant 80 minutes. Turning the box, we get a lot more symbols with a lot more claims. Starting on the left, we have the symbols for 12-month shelf life, recycle, natural ingredients, and cruelty-free. On the right, we have paraben-free, gluten-free, non-GMO, and reef safe. On this side of the box, we have a company description and an ingredients list. The label does not include the percentages of zinc oxide or niacinamide in the product. It is, however, on their website and in their ads. On the bottom, printed directly on the plastic, not on the box, is the production date and the expiration date for this product. This product claims to be clean, skincare, and sunscreen. Let's test it. Now that we have all the details on this, let's open this baby up. I am curious to see if this really is clear and how moisturizing it is and if it's really greasy because if it is this will be my holy grail product okay if it is clear and not greasy ooh all right it's in a clear it is clear it's in a frosted bottle with a white top and let's give this a shake. All right, so because this is serum -y, I am going to actually measure the one fourth amount into an actual measuring spoon. To, and that's the, this is the amount you need on your face and your neck, not just your face. So usually when a thicker consistency, I put it on two fingers, but with this, I know it's not gonna work, so I'm gonna do it this way. Let's show you what this looks like. It is dropper, it has this button on the top. See? And that fills the dropper up. See what it's like on my hand. Just a touch. Ooh, it's clear. Look. Can you see? It looks like a water bead. And it is serum -y. This is nice. Scent. It really is fragrance free. Let's fill this drop. Let's fill this up. So. doesn't pick up as much as I'd like. I can't fill the whole dropper up at a time. Okay, so that is full with one fourth product. I'm getting the glasses off. I hope I don't spill this. And we're going to apply. And 
There it is. It literally looks like water. Feels great. Oh. oh my gosh. All right, I am going to let this set sink in and show you this is just applied. I look a little shiny, but not shiny. Doesn't feel greasy. There's no smell. Oh my gosh, this is nice. I'm gonna be back in a few minutes once this is set in to show you what I look like <laughs> after it's dried. And then I'll be back completely dressed to tell you my final thoughts with makeup, so. Okay, I'm back. It's been about 10 minutes. I brushed my teeth, gotten dressed, left my hair and this is dry and it is completely clear completely clear it also isn't greasy or dewy it just looks like my natural skin with nothing on it just clean natural skin this is great i am going to do my makeup and show you what and show you what that looks like over this this has no texture to it so i expect it's going to work well Especially since what I'm using on my skin is base product. It's just a tinted sunscreen. And I'm going to do my makeup and I will be back to show you what I look like in a bit. Okay, I have finished my makeup for the day. This is it. Isn't it pretty? Everything went on beautifully, beautifully over this product. This is amazing it is clear it isn't greasy it feels like nothing on the skin it dries down beautifully it is everything most everything that it claims to be some of the claims i'm not sure about but this is a fragrance free it is zinc oxide it is chemical free according to the ingredients it feels good on the skin it has no fragrance it's it's not greasy it's not shiny it, my makeup that I put over top went over well. It is lovely. I highly recommend this sunscreen if you're a, dark, a darker complexion like me and you need a sheer mineral because this is it. I like this so much that I wish they would make this formula as a body sunscreen for all over. That would be so awesome if you could get this as a full body sunscreen. Um, this is good. This is really good. My only complaint is the dropper. I wish it was a better quality dropper if you could get more in the stock dropper at one time. That's it. If you're looking for sheer mineral sunscreen, I know I've said that a million times, I highly recommend this one. As always, my name's Mimi. Please like and subscribe. Bye-bye.